Hello, I'm Kim Lundgren, a business analyst for Saline Consulting and a certified Salesforce.com administrator. At Saliant, we build custom software for businesses, and my role is to help guide our clients in how to make the best possible use of Salesforce. This is an ongoing series of Salesforce basics, and today I'd like to cover custom links. This is going to be a quick video about the custom links functionality in Salesforce. After logging into Salesforce, the custom links section appears in the sidebar of the Home tab. Your admin or another user with a customized application permission can customize this space with links to useful websites such as your company website or a search engine. In addition to websites, an admin can add links to reports or documents from within Salesforce. The admin for my organization has set up several useful links. There is a link to Saline Consulting's website and Saline Consulting's YouTube channel. There is a link to Google and to a Salesforce report. Notice that when I click on these links, with the exception of the report, I leave Salesforce. I can click on my back button to return to Salesforce. Admins also have the option of setting up links that once clicked open up within Salesforce. These links display in their own custom section in the sidebar. Just to show you what that looks like, here is Saliant Consulting's link configured to open up within Salesforce. These sorts of links can be customized by an administrator who has the ability to configure the link's behavior, such as if the link, once clicked, will display in the Salesforce window and if the sidebar will be visible or not. Thank you for watching Saliant Consulting's Custom Links video. If you'd like to see more of these videos, please visit our YouTube channel, Saliant TV. If you would like additional information on Saliant Consulting and what we could do for you, please visit our website at www.salientconsulting.com.